Time for a victory lap, ISIS style. Its men showed off war booty, including American equipment abandoned by the Iraqi army. ISIS is joining the wars in Syria and Iraq together. It filmed these pictures in Raqqa, the stronghold in Syria that was its base for the attack into Iraq. Its leader, Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi, urged Muslims to join the Islamic Caliphate he's declared in Syria and Iraq. Rush because Syria is not for the Syrians and Iraq is not for the Iraqis. The earth is Allah's. The state is a state for all Muslims. The land is for the Muslims, all Muslims. In Baghdad, the new Iraqi parliament met. Iraq's three main groups, Shias, Sunni Arabs and Kurds, need to agree a political future if Iraq is to survive. Other parliaments are just as rowdy, but many MPs here are backed by militias. They adjourned when Sunnis and Kurds walked out. The Shia-dominated government unveiled jets bought secondhand from Russia. Iraq needs wisdom, not more weapons, according to an exiled Sunni leader. I think how many thousands of tons of, of ammunition being used in my country since 1991? The result, broken up uh, country, uh, the social fabric has been destroyed, death and destruction. This is the result of using, uh, using military means over years. Parliamentarians have to take some decisions. The last government took the best part of 10 months to form. Right now, they don't have that sort of time to spare. Too much is happening on the ground, too quickly. Jeremy Bowen, BBC News, Baghdad.